Hello everybody and welcome back to our channel. My name is Terrell. My name is Brendan. And we are BMT Reacts and today we're going to be checking out All Ones Out conspiracy theories. Definitely excited to check out some more All Ones Out. Uh, yes. We haven't checked out All Ones Out in a little minute, um, but we're definitely excited to check out more from him. So let's get into it. Am I so away? He's coming for Shane Dawson. entire five to six hour work shift with only one other person. And you didn't get to pick that peculiar partner you're spending your precious period with. So that meant I was stuck with some crazy characters. And one of those characters was really, really into that new age snorting healing crystals kind of stuff. And he would specifically talk to me about it because I was the only other person there and all we could do for fun was watching bread rice. Since I was contractually obligated to stay, I would just listen to him ramble about how he thought the universe worked. He told me about chakras and how easy it was to open your third eye through LSD. He told what? me about scrying using black mirrors and that it's a common misconception that you can get stuck in the mirror, but that's just a myth. That doesn't actually happen. Which is a good thing, because getting okay. stuck in a mirror is something I'm constantly worried about as an adult. Oh, and he told me that every illness is in your head and that hospitals can already cure anything, but they're not going to because if they cure you, they're going to lose a customer. So yeah, he's just going to stick to his that. essential I, I, oils yeah, and non-vaccinated immune system. Thank you very much. Listen. You can believe whatever you want I to think believe, dogs as long as it's not hurting yourself. <laughs> that one just others, says, okay? I'm upset. <laughs> but denying modern medicine? No. No. <laughs> no, you, you can't do that. No. Since there were still four hours of the workday left and I didn't want to argue with him, I would just respond with, uh-huh. He didn't do crack <laughs> or meth or any hard Pixie drugs that, and rock candy. that would alter his perception of reality. Even though he didn't trust hospitals or doctors, he really believed in the benefits of medical marijuana. If you're ever wondering what kind of person is making your sandwiches, yes, they did give this guy a license to touch your food. Whoa, dude. My sandwich tastes like colors. I learned something about myself that day, and that is, I'm obsessed with crazy people. Even though I didn't believe a word he said, I would still ask him questions just to get him talking. Wait, so you're telling me that everything in Naruto is real? Something about talking to him and hearing his perspective was fascinating. This human that I share a planet with exists. What is a crazy person? A crazy person is not someone who has a weird hobby or <laughs> That's a crazy person. Snake. But then to be a statue. Is someone who, despite having an astronomical is amount real. of evidence pointing to one idea, believes in the lie. Is that Invader Sim? Wait. And maybe I should have consulted one before making this video, but I think crazy people have an unhealthy amount of unchecked distrust and paranoia. I don't know where to even begin talking to crazy people. Their worldview is just so much different than mine. A crazy person will think that someone who has no reason to is lying. I mean... Hospitals are lying about medicine. I don't trust doctors. The government's lying about... Well, a lot of things. Yeah, a lot of yeah, people. Okay, 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 that one might be true. Thankfully, I don't personally know any crazy people. A Mario? Well, okay, some of my friends are into astrology, but they still get vaccinated, so, you know, you win some, you lose some. However, on the internet, there's an overwhelming abundance of crazy people. I'm guessing crazy people don't go outside because they think the government will target them with directed energy weapons or something. What? Yeah, only crazy people stay inside wasting hours of their life behind computer screens. <laughs> guilty pleasures is that while I'm working, I will listen to crazy people talk for hours. It's weirdly my version of ASMR. I've tried <laughs> listening to podcasts and audiobooks or anything that's good for my brain, but there's something so fascinating about listening to a 50-year-old genuinely tell you about his alien abduction. <laughs> and it only has 300 views? This man was contacted by aliens, people! Why isn't he on the cover of Time Magazine? YouTube will teach you everything you need to know about aliens. Did you know that aliens traveled millions of light years to build pyramids, stomp on our corn, and abduct a couple of crackpots? Oh There's my god. There's videos of people who will tell you in full confidence about the gray and praying mantis aliens living among us. I mean, <laughs> the videos barely have any views but they exist. <laughs> I want to watch one. Coming. I don't. Okay, all of them. I don't understand <laughs> yeah, how sure people think title. the moon landing was faked. There is so much evidence proving that the moon isn't even real. Wake up, sheeple! Stop! I, be honest, I don't think flat earthers are real. I think they're all just a bunch of trolls trying to get people like me to hate humanity. <laughs> I'm no rocket scientist, but I know that our understanding of space and gravity is so beyond what shape the Earth is. Oh my god. Oh my god. I starved the butt. Information yes. is available to people, but they still choose not to believe it. 
So, I'm sorry, I just can't accept that flat earthers are real. I mean, I have nothing to back up this idea, though. I guess it's just a crazy theory of mine. Wait. Here's a lighthearted conspiracy for you. Some people think that the creators of the Sonic movie purposely made the design of Sonic bad in the first trailers as oh a my god. Boy. Oh my god. Oh my god. And ended up talking about it, giving the movie free promotion. Meanwhile, the executives were planning to use the better designed Sonic all along. The evidence for this is. Well, they could have did that. That does make sense. So I feel like, I feel like they messed up and they just they changed the last Another minute. piece of evidence is. Look at this. What is this? There's yeah, because no the first design was awful. It was awful. Or anyone with two eyeballs would okay this ever. And honestly, I might have believed this conspiracy theory if this movie didn't exist. <laughs> True. That's what I'm saying. Like, they probably thought it was okay. They were doing too. But because it's current here and these types of things can still get past test screenings, I think sometimes Hollywood is just no good. I could be totally wrong, though. If anyone watching worked on this movie and wants to be a whistleblower, let me know in the comments. Ooh. Another rabbit hole I fell down was discovering a group of people called targeted individuals. Targeted individuals are a group of people that think the government is sending NSA agents to harass them. And this isn't just the American government. It turns out that every government in the world is harassing random citizens. <laughs> they claim that they're being harassed because the government what? is trying to silence them for speaking the truth. And in reality, they're not speaking anything remotely true. Oh my, a that toilet paper. individual will say things like, people keep following me. There's a white van that's been that corona. my house for oh. hours. The government's been using electromagnetic radiation to transmit sounds and thoughts into my head and the whole time i'm watching these people i'm thinking yo that sounds like schizophrenia my dude i don't know your life maybe you just got out of a really bad cult and you do have stalkers following you okay yes that happens but it's not the government one targeted individual i saw said that the government attacked them with a directed energy weapon and that they've been having migraines and coughing up blood and I'm just flabbersmacked that someone actually believes this. How do you tell do this them, sick. yo, the government's what? not harassing you. You probably have something going on in your digestive system. Yeah, yeah. You need this to be a doctor and a psychiatrist. And For a vibe check. You can laugh and make fun of these people, but after hearing their stories... I just feel bad for them. They are going through some major mental stuff. Yes. And I think they just need a friend to talk to. Most conspiracies can be disproven with a little bit of research. So it's important to think critically and not immediately believe everything you hear online. Yes. And if there's not enough data to make a judgment, then it's okay oh my God. to say, I don't know. Or Do not finish that puzzle this yet. Please don't. A conclusion. Viral misinformation punishes everybody, so it's important to do research, tests, and evaluations to form a concrete judgment before you hit that retweet button. There is one conspiracy theory, I believe, and that is that Jeffrey Epstein didn't kill him. Oh. Are there any conspiracy theories that you believe in? Feel free to rethink your life. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so I don't know, because... I think conspiracies, it, it depends on what level you take it to. Because, like, someone yeah. like Shane, like Shane Dawson, everyone knows Shane Dawson is known for, like, conspiracy theories, YouTube. Like, Shane does it in a very, Shane does it in a very playful way, but it's also very informative. You can tell that Shane, when he does it, Shane does it in ways that, like, he actually, like, does his research and things like that. But it, it sometimes I think people can get caught up in it so much, and it becomes yeah. so serious. Like, I, like, the thing, like, something as simple as, like, um the earth is flat or like they didn't land on the moon. The moon landed was fake. It's something that just brought up is so it's brought up so much. It's just like yeah. I like it's just legit <laughs> be like looking at people and like how they be like explaining it and they be like so serious. Like people oh, actually yeah. believe oh, it. Yeah. They be so serious and like what they believe it, I'll just be like, Wow, you care too much about this. You need to calm down because like you care way too much. Yeah, some people like as I know like about like the moon landing and like all that, like they like genuinely believe that, and I'm like, I mean, like, I guess you can believe what like, you want. Like, I don't, I don't disbelieve like, it. I'm not saying I don't like not believe it. I'm just saying, I don't think like I don't. I'm not. I'm saying like you don't have to not believe it, whatever. But like, I don't know. Like when they believe, it's also it also. Like, <laughs> maybe like people be crazy. Like I mean, I, I, I guess I can also understand where you're coming from because it's like they care so much about something that doesn't really even affect you. Yeah, because it's like we're never like. Are you ever gonna go to the moon? Like, why does it? Like, like I don't know. It it's like, yeah. I don't. I don't think I ever really have. There's never because the, I will say, the Shane Dawson conspiracy theory about the pizza at Chuck E. Cheese. 
I feel like it's yeah, that true. was real. I didn't I'm pretty that, sure though. that's real. Like, I, when he I, said that, yeah. I was like, I don't even think that's a conspiracy theory. I feel like everybody knew that Chuck E. Cheese like does that. <laughs> like, I that's like the that only one where, like, when he brought it up, I was like, you know what? I like ever sense. since I was a kid, yeah, I was like, it always, yeah, yeah. yeah. But um, I'm glad that all one out, all, it's all one out is finally like diving. He's diving into like the conspiracy thing, like Shane as well. We getting some more YouTubers diving into yeah. the conspiracy oh, yeah. pool. Um, but these are always just um, he's always hilarious. These are always hilarious. Yes. Oh my gosh, he man, he's he so funny. funny. Yeah, it's so great. Um, and we yeah. had that joke about like the toilet paper and the yeah, the corona. corona. <laughs> oh my god, let's not talk about the corona and all the conspiracies and everything. But it's the, too much. Oh, it's, so it's too much. <laughs> but Just right, wash your hands. <laughs> wash your hands. <laughs> but alright guys, that is all for this reaction. If you like it, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you also hit that subscribe button and comment down below for more reaction requests. It can be more all ones out. Anybody will react to it. Also, do not forget to follow us on our social medias. Yes, but that is all for this reaction and we are out. Bye! Bye. Thank you.